Teenage Mutant Ninja Pirates, Teenage Mutant Ninja Pirates, Teenage Mutant Ninja Pirates, stealing all your movies, hoodlum power. Ah, it feels so good to be so bad. Get the latest in film reviews from inthecan.net, preventing mind vomits by recommending only the best. I think I speak for most fans when I say that nobody really gives two turtle turds about the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles reboot of 2014. Call it the Michael Bayisms or the creepy designs, but the entire thing just feels wrong on almost every level. But strangely, there's something about it that just says we have to watch it. And whether it's the same masochistic driving force that gets the latest Transformers film over the billion dollar mark at the box office, or simply a cynical desire to see how bad it could really be, this film is something that audiences are going to watch. If they could watch it. TMNT released in America on the 8th of August, and in South Africa it'll be released by UIP on the 17th of October. That's more than two months apart from the domestic release. Now let me ask UIP something. Do you want piracy? Because that's how you get piracy. Sure, the film will make money when it releases here, but for the people that want to watch it, BitTorrent is just a click away, and there's nothing you can do about it, except release it within a week of the American release like every other major blockbuster. Seriously, South African distributors, you're asking for piracy. Forget asking the media to hand in our phones before previews of 3D movies. You're basically giving the general public an open invitation to download the newest movies. And to be honest, I don't even feel bad for you. Now apparently, the only reason why the release was delayed was because of a poster that made an allusion to the 9-11 bombing. Insensitive? Yes. Boneheaded, definitely. Reason enough to delay a film by two months? Not a chance. Because unless you've forgotten, the World Trade Center bombing happened in the US and not South Africa. Media theorists suggest that eventually online streaming will make traditional cinemas obsolete. And as much as I don't want to agree with them, you're laying down the paving for this by being so far behind the curb that you figuratively started reversing up your own ass. Release the goddamn movie, release it on time, or just don't release it at all, because even though I'm defending what looks like a piece of crap on my childhood, I actually care about our film industry, and I can't be the only one here. We've identified that people aren't all that interested in watching the shitty South African movies that you're putting out. The only way to make money is by getting asses in seats for whatever CGI crap fest is the biggest thing of the moment. And right now, TMNT is just that, for some retarded reason. So do yourself a favor and do everyone else a favor. And if this sounds selfish, maybe it is, but we've earned the right to be selfish when it benefits you in the long run. Do you agree with us? Hit that subscribe button and give our video a like. And while you're there, comment with the story of when you were disappointed because a movie was delayed with its release in South Africa. Thanks for watching, and as always, stay tuned to inthecan.net.